Hi everybody, it's Anne Emery back with another Excel tutorial specifically for evaluators. This video is about creating, editing, and protecting your sheets. If you look in the lower left hand corner, sheets are these little things that look like tabs. I already have one that says welcome. Sheet 1 is my raw data that I downloaded from our online survey tool and you can see sheet 1 is the, the default name for it. I like to keep my raw data and my clean data separate when I'm working, so I just make a copy, right click, check this little box that says create a copy. Now you've got two identical sheets. You want to rename them. We'll call this one raw and we'll call the other one clean so that you don't get confused. If you need more sheets, you can open as many as you need. You can also recolor your sheets. Sometimes people like to have one red, let's say to draw attention to it. I like to keep my raw data protected so that I don't accidentally delete something later in case I need to get back to the raw data. So you just right click, click on protect sheet, you don't really need to set up a password unless it's super private data or something. Just click OK. And now if you click on a cell, let's say you hit the backspace key, you can't accidentally delete something later. It gives you this little pop-up message that says your sheet is read only. If you need to undo it, no big deal. Just right click again, click on unprotect sheet. Let's say you want to just hide your raw data to keep it out of the way and keep your, your whole file a little bit nicer. You can just right click hide, it's not deleted, it's just kind of hidden behind the scenes and you can always get it back by clicking unhide. There it is, unhide the raw data, it's back. So I hope you enjoyed learning about creating, editing, and protecting sheets. Thank you!